Hi folks, Michelle here with The Baby Cubby today, and we're gonna be chatting all about the Up A Baby Cruise. Uh, this is their premier single modular stroller. We really do love it. It has some really awesome features that you're gonna love, and we're gonna review the whole stroller for you today. Okay folks, so first we're gonna cover some features that we absolutely love about the Cruise. So one of the features is obviously that it's a modular stroller. Modular means that the seat can turn to face you or it can face out. So right now it's facing out, but the cruise is actually super easy. So if we go ahead and just press these two gray buttons on the side, just flips around and the seat's really light so it doesn't take a lot of like effort to turn it around. Fits in really well. And with that too, the seat has a really, really deep recline. They still don't recommend it for use until your baby um, is three months so they can like control their head a little bit or hold it up. But again, it makes for a really great little makeshift bassinet. So that's something we love about this seat. Another thing that we love about the Uppa Baby Cruise is all of the accessories that they included. So they, a lot of single strollers don't actually come with accessories. It's just the frame and the seat. But Uppa Baby being a premium brand, they include some of those accessories for you so you don't have to purchase them separately. So one, one of those is the bug net and the rain shield, which will cover the seat. If you're living in the city, that's a great option for you. Another option is this belly bar that comes with it. Um, we love the belly bar for a couple reasons. Number one, it's a great place to like hang toys when your baby gets a little bit older and they need some distractions. So something I always do with my stroller is I'll take, swing the belly bar open, uh, put one of those hanging toys through here and hang it on my belly bar and then close it back up. That way no toy is gonna get lost for my child and it's just gonna hang off for it. And then the last thing we absolutely love that like only Epa Baby does, and it's amazing, are these extra large canopies. So the canopy by itself is already pretty large, but then it has this extra flip out sunshade so that if you're walking directly into the sun, it is like totally covering your child. You're not gonna have any sun in their eyes. You're not gonna have to worry about it. It also has an SPF of 50, so you're, they're not gonna get sunburned at all either. Okay, so now we're just gonna go over some of the other features of the Epa Baby Cruise. So first off is the mat, is the magnetic peekaboo window. Number one, it's a really large window. Let me just do that. So it's a really large, I have yet to see like very many other strollers that have this big of a peekaboo window. And then two, these are magnets, not Velcro. So if your baby's asleep or your child is asleep, you're not gonna wake them up by putting it up to see them. Also, if it's like a hot day and you need some extra um, airflow in their seat, super easy to just roll that up and put the little toggle in there and that way they can get some extra airflow, which is fantastic. The cruise does have a telescoping handlebar. So all you do is press this button and move it up. Um, and as you can see, it's pretty tall. I'm five foot three and it's coming to my chest. So you're gonna be able, it can really accommodate the really, really tall people and also the really short people like me. So that's an awesome option. So the next thing is the brake. So this brake is super easy and nice. So a lot of the time we talk about one touch brakes being kind of the standard and what we love, but this brake is actually really nice. It's not a one touch. You still have to flip it up and down, but it's really easy to flip down because of the big red pedal. Sometimes they're like off to the side. And I don't love that because you always kind of nick your shoe on the frame, but because it's in the center, you won't nick it. And then it's really easy to flip up with just your foot. So even if you're wearing sandals, you're not gonna ruin your toe, like hurt your pedicure or like scratch your toes up or anything. You can just flip it up with the top of your foot. Call it good. Okay, folks, so another feature about the stroller is the adjustable footrest. It's super easy to adjust. You just have push these two gray buttons on the side and then you can adjust it up or down depending on your child's preferences. If you need something, that, if you need it to be out of the way um, for if you have something in the basket or if you need it more up for them if they're wanting more of like an actual footrest that they can spread out on. So that's a great feature as well. And then we wanted to cover the suspension as well. Since it is a single stroller, most single strollers do not feature a lot of suspension. The Cruise isn't really an exception to that. I would say that it does have more suspension than other strollers like it. The Uppa Baby Cruise wheels are made from a full rubber instead of a hard plastic. It's like a lot of cheaper brands. So the rubber is actually going to take the shock a little bit better. So you will have a smoother ride compared to some of those other options. As well, the front wheels do lock on the stroller, which is actually a, good, a feature that isn't on a lot of other single strollers. Um, I will note that it's a little trickier to lock these wheels 
than some of the other ones just because it kind of has to be in the right place but once you get used to it you should be okay but as you can see i just pushed this down and then wiggled it and now it's locked that's great for if you're going over grass or gravel things where your wheel is going to be going like this a lot um, and that way it'll just keep it straight, give you a better ride and more control. Okay, so the last feature is the fold. All of the Effa Baby strollers fold similarly. So uh, at least the Cruise and the Vista. So you can extend or keep the handlebar in. I prefer to extend it. And then you take these two right here and it just folds down super easy. And it automatically locks in place. And then it does stand when it's folded, but it can fall over just depending on what kind of uh, ground you're on. So just be aware that it, might not stand like right away all by itself as so, well if you have a smaller trunk you can again fold down that um, footrest and then you'll gain a little bit of extra space in your trunk so that's a nice feature as well and then to unfold it you're just going to unclip this lock right here and then just walk it back so it's super easy you can do it if especially if you're getting like in and out of taxis or in and out of cars a lot that's a great feature to have so for a regular single stroller, the Epic Baby Cruise is definitely on the high end. It ranges from $499.99 to $549.99, depending on the model that you get. The base model with the silver frame and the regular colors, that's going to be the $499. And then this is a carbon fiber frame, so it's going to be in the mid-range. And then they have luxe versions that have like leather finishings instead of this uh, foam. And that's going to be the $549 price. If you're going to purchase this stroller, it's definitely a great option. However, we would recommend that if you're wanting to get a lot of use and this is your first child, to maybe consider the Upper Baby Vista instead so that you can add a second seat later. Since that's basically the cruise just beefed up a little bit. So this does come in a variety of colors and Upper Baby does a really good job at making gorgeous colors for their strollers. You can check them all out and shop them at babycubby.com on our website. And if you have questions, make sure you email us at hello at babycubby.com or comment below. We'd absolutely love to answer any questions that you guys have about this stroller and make sure that we're giving you all the best information and what you need. Okay, so now onto some of the things that we don't love about this stroller. There's not one feature that we think is really pretty, like a deal breaker. So I do wanna talk a little bit about some of the reviews that we've heard from customers and things about the stroller from people who've used it a lot. Um, one of the things we've heard a lot is that after a year or so, the wheels start getting stuck. So they can like turn sideways and get stuck um, or they start the ride isn't as smooth as it used to be because the cruise does have a really smooth ride. Like the maneuverability on this stroller is pretty amazing. You can just turn it really easy with one hand, especially with this carbon fiber frame one. Um, but again, after a while, people are saying that that gets a little harder to turn and a little harder to maneuver. Something though to mention is that Up A Baby does do like uh, gear up events where they will come and like service your stroller for free. Um, there's been reports about the people getting their wheels replaced for free um, and getting like mechanisms all tuned up and fixed. So if you are having issues with your stroller after a year or so, number one, contact Up A Baby. Their customer service is amazing. And then number two, if you do have a tune up and gear up event in your area from Up A Baby, definitely take your stroller in and they'll get that fixed. From reviews that we've heard and seen and gotten after they went to those events, that's when their stroller started working fine again. So you just need to make sure you're upkeeping on your stroller. Okay, so one last thing too that we've heard from a few customers is that this frame can scratch kind of easily. So uh, just like these metal parts of it, especially on the silver one, we've heard that it can get scratched up and a little beat up over time. So just be aware that that has been a concern for some customers. So if you're not okay with that, it might be good to consider a different stroller if you want it looking new all the time. So just some other considerations with the Cruise. It does accommodate a lot of uh, car seats, especially the really popular brands. So of course it accommodates the up a baby Mesa car seat and you don't need any extra adapters for that. And then with adapters, you can also use a Nuna Pippa, a Cybex, a Maxi Cozy, or a Kiko. So you do have to purchase separate adapters in order to use that, but all you would do is pop off the seat and then put the adapters uh, where the seat goes. So your adapters would go right here and then you can click in your car seat. So it turns into a travel system really easily, which is such a great feature, especially if you're a city walker or if you have a lot of errands that you're running. So 
that's a great option for you. The Cruise has a 50 pound weight capacity for the seat, which will is great because it will accommodate your older children, especially since it's a taller seat. And then the stroller itself weighs 22 pounds, so make sure that that's gonna be okay for you with your lifestyle if you're like having to walk up to your apartment or having to get it in and out of cars a lot. Thank you so much for watching. You guys remember that you can shop it at babycubby.com where we do free shipping all day, every day. And then if you liked, if you enjoyed this video, <laughs> Make sure to give us a thumbs up and we would love to hear if you guys have any questions or feedback. So leave us a comment below or email us at hello at babycovey.com. We'll see you soon.